This edition of You Think TV is sponsored by Bagogo.com. Bagogo, a great place to find the perfect gift. I have a lot of favorite childhood memories. Probably playing with my little fox terrier dog as much as anything. <laughs> Actually, it's a Labor Day weekend thing. And it was when I was a kid and we used to go down to the Jersey Shore and we'd go to the beach all day and have a great time. And then and that we'd do on Saturday or Sunday. And then when we came back on Monday, our next door neighbors always had this huge like clam bake picnic that was really, really good. <laughs> I was about seven or eight, but it was it was fun. There were six of us, and my favorite childhood memory is I, I was from a small town, and uh, going t on Saturdays to what we called a creek, which to us it was a big river then, but it was a creek, and my dad would pull his car out in the creek and wash it, and us kids would get to go swimming. Probably drinking <laughs> pickle juice from a child, child's teapot at the home of a very dear friend. <clears throat> and we're still friends today. <laughs> Traveling with my family. I think Christmas. I have a lot of memories around Christmas and being with my family and lots of food and opening presents, although we never really had many presents. Uh, but I always remember there would be excitement and a lot of laughing, and so I think all the memories would be around Christmas. I think my father giving me money to go for an ice cream cone every night. Chris Christmas. Opening up presents on Christmas morning. Being with my wonderful grandparents, who are not here any longer, um, and visiting them every summer, and uh, just having that wonderful closeness with those neat people. What? Okay. That was special. Traveling with my family across the country. We used to take our uh, cardboard boxes and flatten them down, and we'd climb over the fence. See, we were naughty, but we'd climb over the fence to the swimming pool in the wintertime and slide down the deep end on our cardboard boxes. That was great fun, but if you're not tall enough, you can get stuck down the deep end because you can't reach the ladders to climb up because there's no water in the 